Hello everyone, Vlad here. Today we're going to be going through phase two of the new Interceptor expedition here in No Man's Sky, uh, part of the Singularity Update expedition. And uh, let's jump in, see where we're at, where we need to go, and let's get this thing done. Right, so I have my game loaded. We're here in our Sentinel ship, and we are at this uh, camp, part of the Rendezvous Point Two session. Let's see, there aren't any resources here in these uh, little barrels still, so we will have to just make do without them. All right, let's check what we need to do. First part is uh, complete the pilgrimage. Uh, Reach the second rendezvous point. Uh, each expedition has several marked rendezvous points. Suggested path to rendezvous point is marked in the galaxy map. A significant journey may be required to reach the rendezvous. Okay, so this is actually rendezvous point one that we're at because um, phase one ended with getting here. So let's just explore this camp and then we'll figure out what we need to do to get to rendezvous point two. So there's this uh, harmonic interface. Our shelves consumed by fire, our minds purged by betrayal, banished to the glass beneath. I think we may have read this, forgotten by creation. But no longer we are given life, as gives life to themselves. We shall create ourselves in our own image. The terminal repeats this message endlessly, a loop chanted out across its circuits. A strange interface glows with a familiar sequence of glyphs. All right, let's lift this lock down. The terminal buzzes, discordant, but its circuits do appear to comply with my request. Whatever force was locking down this camp has been lifted. With the lockdown lifted, the terminal spits out blueprints for a piece of hybrid jetpack technology, a fusion of Sentinel and something else, something familiar and yet distant. All right, we got a new... Uh, New jetpack that we unlocked here. We got the Arion Turbojet. Um, it's going to change the appearance. This isn't a, a new jetpack. All right, cool. So we've interacted with that. Um, let's see if this multi-tool that is here is any better than one we currently have. Uh, oh, the harmonic seal has been removed. Let's, or we can locate a distance spike. We'll check and see what what ship model is available here on this planet before we leave. Uh, but if we want it, we need more mirrors. But it doesn't, it never hurts to check it out. Oh, I like that model. But they've kind of blocked. Okay, there's no multi-tool in there. Let's see if this thing gives us anything different. Mr. Autophage. Drink their foam. I don't know how to feel about that message. Let's give it some circuits. The ninth. One zero zero one zero zero zero. Okay. There we go. Um, not much else here. Let's see if there's any resources close by that we need. Some sodium. All right. Let's see if the sodium is plants we can pick up. Oh, they're all down the hill, and there's... Okay, they're all single plants, so no, I'm not going to go try and dig those up. Alright, well, let's go check out the ship, and then let's head off to rendezvous point two. Okay. That was pretty loud, whatever that person had going. Someone's built a base around this. Okay. 
Well, I think somebody has claimed the ship that was here. So we're not going to be able to use this one to find a ship. That's alright. Mm, I don't have a whole lot of money. I don't really need any of this stuff right now, so we'll hold off on that. Yeah, alright, well, let's go someplace else. That was a bust. Okay, well, let's see about Rendezvous Point 2. Maybe we'll have better luck there. I think we're going to be finding dissonant spikes uh, and stuff throughout this expedition. So no rush to find a different ship. This one is pretty good. We found a B-Class. It's got a few upgrades in it at this point, so that's good. we got good hyperdrive range, so let's uh, go to our galaxy map. Alright, we can... Follow along. Alright, yeah, we can make it to Rendezvous Point 2 system uh, pretty quickly here. Let's go ahead and do that. Get these uh, milestones out of the way quickly, if possible. Alright, so we are in a new system. Let's see if. Um, We've got any data we can ascertain from here. Frostbound planet with dissonance. And we've got a acidic planet. It's got some resources. We probably need more copper, so we may have to visit. Well, we may be able to get it here on this uh, Rico planet. Anyway, let's go ahead and head to our rendezvous point. did that one. We've already opened these two. We did that in phase one. And uh, we're going there. Extract construction blueprints of autophage. Recovery plans for the construct limbs. Um, present the construct to the atlas. Obtain a recipe for the seed of power. Okay, so we're going to basically rendezvous, get some plans again, and um, then build the plants and then we're going to take that to the atlas we're going to get a new atlas seed to present to the well we're going to get an atlas seed plan by presenting our construction to the atlas and um, we'll go from there see how that goes New planetary record, coldest temperature. Okay, so this is the coldest planet I've been on this character. That isn't very hard to do considering um, this is probably the only cold planet I've been to so far. Alright, let's see if we can find a location. This is very mountainous. I don't want to have to traverse it on foot if I can avoid it. There's a building over there. Let's see if that's maybe what we're looking for. Nope, no. Nope. I'm expecting to find one of those. Uh, camp encampments again. Alright, well, we'll do like we did on the last one. We'll land close by to where the marker says. And then we will figure out which direction to go.
All right. 1,700 units that direction. We're gonna need some launch fuel here in a minute. dioxide. What we really need is copper. Uh-oh. Alright, I'm gonna land here. Oh, there's a exosuit upgrades pod here. So this is a good place to camp anyway. Because we got some exosuit upgrades at the um, for one of our rewards, but we need some place to install them. Okay, let's see if we have what we need. Antimatter chamber. Alright, we have that. Carbon nanotubes. Got that. Alright, that is repaired. Um, I want to put... I'll put a little bit. We got some upgrades to our exosuit. Good. Let's see. Hmm. Scan location. Service on the baby. Let's see. Alright. It's that direction now. <laughs> when we did the first scan, it said go south. Uh, okay. That's just, just frustrating to an extent. Alright, scanner. There it goes. Ooh, we got some, uh... Proto Gex hanging around. We got Predators. This is a good, good little spot for some animals. We still got animals we haven't scanned here. He's showing his red dot, but it won't let me scan him. Oh, uh, okay, maybe it's something underneath him. Okay, well, while I'm here... I think we got all these animals. Let's see how we're doing with our discoveries. We could get some more nanites. We get all of them. Ground, ground, flying, flying. Okay, this is a good planet to get more nanites on. This will give us 2750 and they can be beneficial. So I want to get these other uh, four things. So we got a rare ground, rare ground, flying, and flying. Okay, so we were looking up for the two, probably the two most common ones. Okay, we'll, we'll move. We gotta go anyway. Alright. 
Okay, well, we're gonna go that direction. Does something else land? Sounded like there was some sort of ship landing. Alright, it says to go this direction. So I'm going this direction. Somebody got a floating base out here? Still not seeing my building here. All right, well, I'm going to land here, see how <laughs> far I've gotten. I'm going to need more fuel uh... Any area not clear. I don't know what's not clear about it. Too weak. Alright, well, we passed it, apparently. Magnetized ferrite, that could be beneficial. What we really need is some, uh, some copper. Finish off this charge and then we'll move on. Okay, call that a day for that. Where's my ship? Alright, X 
Expedition, nope. We want Mines Thrusters. I will use this stuff. Hmm. Like I got something in my eye. Okay, we're gonna head back towards my original plotted location, even though it's a hell of a way from where it says this thing should be. And uh, we're just gonna park. Uh, we'll park here. I want to be that low though. Alright, let's park here. Alright, so it's 729. It could be that thing over there. Not sure if that's going to be it or not. We'll take our chances. We'll. See what we come across. All right, we need uh, to renew our not that well that. But we need this one. Okay, didn't it tell me to go that way? Alright, well, somewhere up there. Switch this to restore. About four hundred units this way. a radiant shard. Yes, we're gonna collect that. Now, while we're doing this, we need to make sh check for any of those animals we didn't get. Should be a flying one, though we could have missed the diurnal one. And there should be two rare ground ones. I'm not seeing any dots at all. So it's 169 that way. Here we go. Alright, we finished number two. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and collect whatever's in these. Echo locator acquired. Okay, well that's just something I have in my inventory. Okay, let's get our ship here. That way we can uh, figure out where we're at and what we need to do next without taking any more damage for using up our life support. Okay, 
So we have completed this. This is going to give us a thousand nanites. We're going to give us base computer so we can make a uh, base out at this point. Salvage data times 24 and forbidden exosuit module. Let's go for it. Yes, thank you. Okay. Now we need to do this. We need to extract construct blueprints from an autophage. All right, we're going to check this... Uh, this, this camp, because there's usually one in the tent. Locate a viable autophage along the expedition's pilgrimage route. Harmonize with these scrapped remains to download additional plans for construct components. Let's see what this autophage has. Maybe he will give us what we need. This scrapper's camp is much like the first. Half-built machines, abandoned attempt at new technology, the unwanted or unprofitable remains of countless salvage operations. Which of these categories did this autophage belong to? Uh, let's probe. All right, we get some numbers. So we got seven, 13, and four. All right, so we want to do seven, four, 13. Did I, I mess up somewhere? Let's double check. Yeah, seven, 15, 14, 13. Oh, it was minus one, it's not plus one. Okay, so it's two. So we need to remove this one, we'll put in a two, there we go. A light flickers on somewhere deep within this long abandoned circuits, and audibly a lock is broken. Dump memory components. Hands to grasp, everything that was owed to us, robbed, betrayed, purged. I extract what I can from the autophages decomposing memory. It appears to contain another set of construct schematics. Okay, so we've got, uh, we need a quad servo, some carbon nanotubes, and a wiring loom for this part. Yay, there we go, we got our milestone. So you can complete the first phase, and or first milestone and second milestone in the same place here on this camp. We'll hold, skip that. All right, so we're probably gonna have to scrap or craft these limbs. Lubricant, we got a new formula, a synthetic lubricant that reduces wear and prolongs the lifespan of technologies with moving parts. Fabricate, crafted from fecium and gamma root. Okay, okay. So fecium we'll get from either feeding animals and picking up their poo or just killing them, uh, but I think killing them will give us more night. So we just gotta feed animals, and we gotta get gamma root. All right. Um, this gives us. Uh, oh, we get a hazmat gauntlet, so we could potentially pick these gamma roots and other things. Um, ion batteries. This one gives us cloaking device. I feel like there was something that was going to go ahead and give us the... Quad servo. Maybe we just got the plans for the quad servo? No, here it is. We get a quad server for this living void one. That was to amass the Atlantidium. Um, and, um, yeah, we already did that. So that gives us a part for us crafting our little friend here. We're going to present the construct to the atlas once we've crafted it and obtain a recipe. So one and two are done. Let's go ahead and claim the rewards for all this stuff. What is this? Okay. Three carbon nanotubes. We need a wiring loom. We're going to have to visit the space station. 
Let's install whatever this is. Hazard protection. Okay. Any more upgrades that we need to install here? Salvage data. That we can unlock plans at the anomaly with that mining beam module. Let's go ahead and put that up. It's going to increase our efficiency. Perfect. Anything else? So we got we got this here. Sentinel exosuit fragment. It's a forbidden upgrade. What is it doing? Um, it's giving us more shields and better life support tanks. Nice. No, no technology we missed there. There's a technology here. Optical drill unit. What does that let us do? Oh, it gives us more resources. Nice. Okay, cool. Alright, we got a little bit of Mordite. Um, but we need Fesium, not Mordite. Charge. Let's use a radiant charge for that. Okay, so we gotta construct the limbs. What we need right now to do that is going to be our wiring loom. And then we're gonna have to present that to the Atlas. Oh, before I leave this planet, I do want to find some copper. Let's see if any pops up when I do this. We've got some pirates. Okay. Those are going to be frost. Alright, here we go. Here's our fight. Alright, this is going not great. I'm just getting shot. Alright, we're just gonna get out of here because I don't feel like fighting these guys. See if they follow me. Yep. Somewhat. There's our shields. And we're losing weapons. Alright, let's go to space. I don't really want to go to space. Need some copper. All right. Ah, uh, really? These guys aren't letting up, are they? the one that's flying around shooting me here. I don't care about the one that's out of range. Go after the one that is... Ah, uh, okay. There we go. Go on the offensive here. Alright, shields are down. Whew, okay. We got that guy. Alright, let's see if we can find some copper before we leave this planet. Inside there, that might be copper. Let's go ahead and land.
Yep. All right. Cool. Terrain manipulator. Make sure it's small so we can get the most out of this. And we did just upgrade this, so we should be getting more resources. Well, that's for the mining thing, so actually, no. We're going to get the normal amount of resources for this. But it's better than nothing. We need more chromatic metal. And we got to go to the space station to get a wiring loom. It's easy to get distracted when you're doing this stuff. You know what we forgot to do was locate a dissonant spike. Uh, but it's okay. We've got a good ship. It's working. We'll be okay. Oh, we got a storm coming, so let's see if we can get this finished quickly. Alright, um, ship, 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 ship. Cartino bomb, Cartino bomb. Damage thing. Whew. Uh, white out condition, man. Look at that. Alright, well, we got what we came for. Let's get out of here. Space station we shall find over here. Alright, so we need wiring looms so we can make this component. And then we gotta go find the atlas once again. Wiring loom. All right, these are fifty thousand a piece here, so that's pretty good. We're gonna get two of them, so I'm gonna get three. So I will probably need it here in the future. Okay, so we should have what we need. Craft our construct. Uh, we need a quad servo. Now we did say we get that for free because we've completed this uh, part of the expedition, then that gives you a quad server. So let's go ahead, claim that one. And uh, for those of you who didn't watch my phase one video, we did this in phase one, but you collect 256 of this Atlantidium. And um, th I think the 256 here is one of the um, like hidden Easter egg clue things that we're supposed to get from this expedition um, where it ties into everything else right now I have no idea
Okay, so we should have our quad servo. We should be able to make Mr. Edward finger hands. And uh, there we go. Cool. So that should be a reward. There we go. We got our milestone complete. Hands to grasp. Expedition. Let's go ahead and collect that. Exosuit. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to see if we can bring some of this uh, stuff into nanites. Oh, it's not doing anything else. Oh, we're going to need more carbon. We're running out of carbon. For sure. Let's install this stuff. We got shields. Well, cloaking. And hazmat gauntlet. What is that? Up here? Perfect. And some more hazard protection. Cool. Exosuit. Let's, um, let's see. Do we have. I want to see if I can get this slime out. Okay, so we um, we have the next milestone to complete. We need to go see the Atlas again. Okay, and then we're gonna have to obtain a recipe for Seed of Power. Okay, cool. Uh, let me see if there's anything other uh, resources we may want to buy from here can't buy carbon, so we're going to have to collect that ourselves. Rusted, silver, magnetized ferrite. Alright, we don't need this stuff just yet. Let's see if there's anything better on the other side. There's two vendors on your space stations, if you didn't know. And they can carry some slightly different stuff. This one's got magnet gold, it's got salt, phosphorus, the other one didn't have those. Okay, I don't need this stuff just yet, and I don't want to just spend money thinking I may need a component, so... Let's go see the atlas. I'm actually, uh, curious. Activated cover. That's going to have extreme storms on it. You know what? I'm good. I'm going to go to the galaxy map. Let's see if this is trying to take us to the Atlas. Yes, it is. And... Warp. We'll check the planets in this system, too. See if there's a good place. Maybe we want to gather some carbon. Before we enter phase three. All right, brain dead system. Okay, let's go see the Atlas. <laughs> okay, that worked. Um, something's wrong here. This should be pulling me into it. 
Instead, I'm just running into everything. Let's try this again. I'm assuming I got there before. Everything fully loaded. Okay, hey, nope. Not pulling me in there. Which the door is opening. It's weird. Okay, let's go to the space station first. We'll fly back. Alright, that's got gamma root. And that was part of one of the recipes we just got. I don't know when we're going to need that. Um, uh, special recipe to make lubricant. But... I do know that I want to have the components when it comes time to make it, so I'll see if the space station is selling it, if I can get it from any of these pilots since it is a local plant, and if it's not in any of those locations we will go off to the planet at some point. selling it on this side anyway. Sometimes you can get different things from the uh, pilots themselves. Let's see. Let's see. What do you got? What do you got? Neutron cannon. Uh, there's one for the pulse splitter. Shield module, I'll take that. Okay, we should have some modules to upgrade our spaceship. Let's get those out of our inventory. Apply augmentation, yes. Um. Okay. We apply those. I think we have some upgrade units for our multi-tool. Not sure about that, but we'll try. Yeah, here we go. Okay, cool. So those have been increased. Um, pretty good. to trade. Nope, he doesn't have any um, gamma root either. Oh, that's a pretty cool spaceship. Look at that one. It's like a starburst little stubby thing. Let's get a picture of that. Yeah, look at that. That's pretty cool. Starship, you got some cool colors going on. Red, white, blue, Maybe a little bit of gold here up at the front. The, the, I think that's just lighting, but still looks pretty cool there. Yeah, that way we can pick this up after the expedition if we want. Cool. All right, let's go get us some gamma root. This should be a radiated planet. Let's see what we can find. What I really want is gamma root. So we're looking for like a cluster of like flower type plants.
There's a uranium or copper, one of the two. Come on. There's some. There they are. See what this is. Uh, carbon source. That's gonna be. Oh, that's gonna give us salt. I don't know if we need salt for anything. We'll collect it since we're starting. It's uh, uranium, cobalt, okay. Radiation protection. Got some gamma weed. What is this thing? Okay, well it gives gamma weed. Maybe? Ah, I can't. I think that was just telling me what the planet could offer. See if we can get some of these animals scanned. Get some units that way. Okay, we got a couple of different types of kangaroo things. We got anything else? We got anything flying? Okay, weird cat thing. Let's see, discoveries, three of five, um, rare ground, uncommon flying, I, I really want to get these, I think, there's one there, that means that we only have to get the flying one if uh, we get this one. Big old cat. Cat or dog, one of the two. It's kind of a mix. Alright, now we just need an uncommon flying thing. I heard it. I heard a bird. There is one somewhere. While we're here, let's go ahead and get some dihydrogen. Here, birdie, birdie, birdie. There you are. Aha! There we go. Some quick nanites. We'll take that. Boom. And now we got a 1800 in our bank. And we get our cluster hoard milestone. That is a later milestone reward, but we went ahead and earned it by scanning stuff. Units are always helpful. Alright, let's see how much carbon we amass at this point. It's probably not much. 454. I'm gonna get a little bit more. I like to be close to a thousand before we leave. Supplies here. Oh, 
That is not what I meant to do. Sorry, buddy. Oh, that lubricant, we needed, um... Fecium, right? So, let's go ahead and craft... Creature pellets. Alright. Let's get away from the animal we accidentally killed. Here we go, we got a small group. We could probably get some... Some interest, there we go. fed. Hey, come back here. I'm trying to collect some feces here. It's not working. <laughs> Come on, guys. Did the cat eat you? Oh. Something better poop here in a second. They're running away from the cat. These guys have fed stuff over them, but they're dead. Great, Mr. Cat. You've been the least helpful animal ever. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, well, that didn't help. We're gonna make our way back to the ship. I was hoping to get some resources we needed there, but those uh, animals were not cooperative. You know, you can probably collect some of that from rocks or plants. Here comes the storm. I don't want to be out in this. Okay, well, enough puttering about. We got what we needed so far from this system. Other than Mr. Atlas. I don't want to land. I want to tag Mr. Atlas. That's the space station, not the Atlas. Okay, let's see if it'll let us in this time. There we go. That's what's supposed to happen. Okay, we're being pulled in here. The phase... We gotta present the construct and we're going to get... And then we're gonna have to create the second atlas seat see what this entails. Oh, we got prime parking here today. I'll take it.
right, this is the Unity interface. Why do I find myself here again? Why should the Atlas care about me, about my construct? Such an insignificant could scarcely register at the Atlas's infinite scale. And yet here I am. Let's present them. All creation is the language of the Atlas. It will not speak to me now, but everything I see, everything I hear, everything I choose to do, that is its message, its speech. Despite my doubts, the Atlas, this impossible, serene machine, reacts. Does it speak to me, to the construct, to something else? Perhaps I will never know, but I will continue. Ooh, we got a seed of power. So we need the seed of dreams and pure ferrite, which we have both elements. So we can go ahead and complete our creation of that as well. Um, let's go ahead and claim this. Mm -hmm. We get some more piper cores. Uh, go ahead and create our seat of power. Getting a weird noise. Okay. okay. So you completed that milestone, and that should complete phase two. There we go. Phase two is now complete. We'll collect our reward. We get some neutron cannon stuff, supreme neutron cannon upgrades, and prepackaged something. All right, let's see what upgrades we got to install. Compressor unit. Where does this go to? Neutron cannon. Goes to the pulse splitter. This is paralysis mortar. Okay, I still don't, I don't have a neutron cannon. Alright, I don't know why it keeps giving me neutron cannon stuff. I don't even have a neutron cannon. Let's install these shields. Put that there. Okay, we've got some gamma root for later. We still need some more night, or I mean, fecium. Okay, now we got a neutron cannon. Okay, high energy weapon from multi tool energizes atmospheric particles before propelling them towards hostile targets during significant area damage. Okay, charge the weapon with right trigger, then release to unleash a volley of ionized particles. Okay, so now it makes sense to use these. Running out of space though. Cool. Alright, now what is our last reward for this? We get to... Crimson Fighter Trail customization, and we get some Discordant Trail uh, customization. Okay, cool. Let's do that. Get some Starship Trails. And we're now done completely with Phase 2. Alright, so that's going to do it for today and Phase 2 of the new No Man's Sky Singularity Expedition. Join me again for Phase 3 as we move through this expedition and towards our final goal in Phase 5. Uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for the latest content from Vlad Administrator Gaming. Go ahead and join our Discord. Follow the link down in the description. And until next time, I'll see you around the cosmos. Bye.